Hey, we're back, guys. I wanted to show you how to uh, set up that same Air Video app, uh, but using your uh, iPhone, and you're going to actually uh, stream the video if you'd like over your uh, data network. You know, AT and T, Verizon, Sprint, who, whatever. We're going to show you how to set up your router, the settings for that. Now, mind you, if you do this, you're going to use your data plan, and if you set your settings for you know a high bit rate for better quality video, you're going to use a lot of your data on your plan. So I'm giving you a warning now, folks. I don't endorse it, but I'm saying it's an option. I have the unlimited LTE. I'm on the old grandfather plan with AT&T, so I can do this. Now I'm going to show you this because this is very awesome. So uh, make sure you go over to you know nmethod.com download your uh, air video server if you haven't already done that from my previous video mac or pc it's quite simple you want to go over to uh, what is my ip.com that may help you get your uh, home ip address if you don't know it you'll want to know what that is um, as well as you want to maybe open up your uh, router for example we'll get our router opened up here and find something along the lines of like port forwarding um, that you know wherever you forward maybe your xbox your remote desktop find that now like i said uh, when you have that air video application up, um, it's going to see an icon there at the top of your screen. Just right click, you know, here's preferences. Here are your preferences. Now, like we said, here was our shared folders where we had that. And a remote, just if you want to use your router manually, this is the easiest way. Just click enable access from internet. Now, remember, the port we set was under settings. You can listen on custom port, that's whatever you like. So go ahead and do that. That's 45633. Now I did not automatically map port. Now we'll wait to go ahead and test connection. Now come over here to your wireless router and you can see Air Video is the name of, for example, what I named that. The local IP address is the 10.0.0.8 and using that 45633 port. Now that is under port 40 and this is a D-Link uh, DIR uh, 655 router latest release so uh, pretty good device actually so once you have that set come back over here and you can simply click test connection that's gonna tell you if your air video instance is accessible from the internet okay awesome it is so let's go over to your iPhone here let's pull this up now you can see currently I'm on Wi-Fi so let me go ahead and put in my password. Now, let's see here. On this app, slide this over here. Go into the Air Video app. As you can see, I have my list of servers here. Now, like I said, you can add one by clicking Add and it shows your computers on your local network but like I said well what about when we leave we want to watch it over the network over AT&T it's what you said that's where I said your IP address comes in handy now for example I'm still on Wi-Fi so I'm gonna click over you can see I'm I clicked over I'm still on Wi-Fi I can get into my machine so let me click off of Wi-Fi you can see I'm still on the Wi-Fi and there's that list of DVDs like I showed you so let's get off Wi-Fi here hang on just a second okay now you can just simply see I'm on 4G this is not you know a jailbroken iPhone or anything like that now here is there's Bonjour trying to resolve that local IP it can't because well we're not on the local network anymore so you can see we're on 4G now the reason for that outside IP and us putting the port forwarding on is so that our port recognizes well this local Mac wants to go to the outside world so when you open up the server which you simply can do um, if you haven't already just click add new server specify the address manually you put in the port remember we did 45633 the defaults 45631 so for mine I've got it already set so let's just click it give it an instance there now there's those same folders so let's pull up that Christmas story movie like we did from our first one oops pardon me and this is that same movie we are watching we're gonna pick up at our last position however 
you now notice this is on 4G. So here's that, you know, Ralphie's dream scene of, you know, him having the Red Rider BB gun. Great scene. But like I said, folks, uh, we're on 4G. I can't prove it to you any other way. I could jump in my car. I could go anywhere and do this. Like I said, be mindful of your data plan. Be, you know, conscious of how much data you're actually using. But, folks, that's how to set up your uh, Air Video app uh, over 4G. That's uh, all my... You know, all my movies. Maybe you want to flip over to, you know, Hot Tub Time Machine. You know, that is uh, actually a Blu-ray movie uh, that I ripped uh, using a Blu-ray burner here at home. Uh, my own Blu-ray, just a backup copy, uh, MKV file. Because Air Video plays all types of movie content. So you can just play the uh, Hot Tub Time Machine if you like. Uh, like I said, folks, that's 4G. That's a .MKV coming across the network here in just a second because it was at the last position so it'll take just a second for at t to buffer that and it should begin playing here in just a second there you go and that uh, there you go there you go folks if you have any questions uh, just comment me I'll be happy to reply to you it's very easy to set this up so uh, like I said just you need the air video app uh, I need to click on that remote. Don't do the automatically map. I didn't. If your router supports it, try it and then click test connection if it worked great. If not, jump over into it manually. Find something along the lines of port forward and forward that in uh, to your uh, air video. Now, obviously, uh, there's going to be some hackers out there. So, folks, I have a master's degree in computer science about eight years background in uh, IT and Cisco security I will change those ports so uh, it's a generic router for video purposes anyway so if you guys wanna insist on hacking it well I have a Cisco firewall but like I said none of the information exists that's legit after this video so hopefully we can avoid all that but you never know so like I said uh, thanks and uh, please subscribe